Dimash, I'm your fan. I'm your fan forever. Hello everyone, welcome to another video reacting here at Blaze. Today we're coming back to Dimash because as I mentioned in the previous video, I, after listening to his voice, I cannot be anything else but obsessed with his voice. So today I'm going to be reacting to Ave Maria. because there's no words there Ave Maria is pretty much based on a prayer in the in the Bible so I suppose this is just uh, a title that's given that it sounded classical enough for um, whoever wrote this uh, the composer of this piece just to give us a hint that this would have been um, a, a high uh, like an operatic like a classical not operatic I would say operatic like a classical type of of approach into into everything <laughs> previous video of sinful passion that I thought he had the range of a soprano the coloratura and the tone because as always you classify voices by the range but also by the tone so soprano and coloratura are sopranos are the highest spectrum of the vocal uh, the female vocal spectrum but then um, now listening to this i take that back i think he does have both soprano de coloratura tones and range and then soprano ligera which is the kind of like the, the thinner 
higher sound. The song is actually very simple in terms of composition. It has the same melodic line repeated and is slowly going higher and higher and higher. So the actual song is what we call a, a monothematic song. So it has one single melody that repeats and repeats and repeats and repeats. Uh, this is called strophic form. I don't know if it's strophic form because strophic forms you have pretty much a, a whole structure um, a musical idea that repeats and repeats and repeats with different lyrics. So in this particular case, there's no lyrics. It is just a vocalization of it. But then the melody, so it's basically one melody that repeats and repeats and repeats and repeats until it goes so, so far away, so high up. I wanted to remind you that here at Bliss, we not only react to amazing artists singing amazing songs, we also teach piano and singing. And we are offering a free taster. All you need to do is to click on the link in the description box and then you will be brought to our website when you can select what type of tasters you would like to do. You can select from singing to musical theatre to piano and then select at the time and the day that suits you best and we're going to see you on the other side. So at some point try to combine both the, the open sound of the more contemporary uh, approach for the vocals than the than the, the the classical itself but then he continued with with the classical this was just a display of amazing range amazing tone i need to find out what that last note was <laughs> This is, it's, it's the same note that he did before. Well, a, a flat version of that. The approach of the vocals is a lot wider and it's a lot fuller and, but my God. And then he takes it from that high note. He just, he take a breath and he does. You know, to finish here, to play any of these notes, that is, Fantastic. For some reason, this started on some F at the beginning. It started there on F, and he started on some random notes. So beautiful after a long pause of silence there. Wow, it's, it's fantastic. This this artist really, really, and I'm loving this. So suggest for me more songs that you like, that you would like me to review. Dimash, I'm your fan. I'm your fan forever. This is amazing. Not that he needs any fun because he has a lot of fans. I can see that and, and the reaction of the, of the audience and that's very good to see. But my God, he doesn't deserve anything less than that. Fantastic. Beautiful. Beautiful indeed. I hope you have a lovely day ahead and I'm going to see you in the next video. Bye.